Yeah, hi, good afternoon. My name is Bruce Robinson. Uh, I've been asked to do a little bit of a uh, speech on um, uh, Tai Chi, the practical method. Uh, a friend of mine sent me a, a link uh, through the computer and it uh, introduced uh, Master Chen, uh, who's uh, uh, the founder of the practical method. Um, I found it very intriguing. It sounded so much different than other stuff I'd ever done before. I'd studied a little bit of Tai Chi for health. I think based on the Yang style, I'm not certain, but uh, this sounded more like uh, it had something to do with a route that I'd been looking for for a long time. So I contacted a gentleman named Kelvin Ho, um, who's one of uh, Master Chan's disciples, and I attended a couple of weeks, and then I came to this uh, practical seminar, this four-day practical seminar, and I must say, I've been thoroughly impressed. Uh, it, it is far beyond anything I've ever studied before. Um, it, if anybody's looking for something authentic, this is the real deal. Um, Dr. Master Chen goes through uh, a lot of the explanations in very much detail, and then he demonstrates um, the applications, and uh, the power is incredible. It's unbelievable. Um, I would highly recommend, if anybody like myself is looking for a little more authenticity with the Tai Chi they study, um, this, is, uh, this, is, this is something that you should research and, uh, and get involved with. Uh, what I found impressed me the most uh, was the fact that uh, he, um, he talks about going to almost the extreme of physical hardness to attain the softness that a lot of people, uh, there's a lot of misnomers out there about Tai Chi in general, um, and, and that more than anything kind of resonated with me because it uh, it made sense. Your physical body has to be in shape to withstand it, and then you can uh, add that softness to your practice uh, eventually after after some of the training methods. Uh, there's a basic foundations method. Uh, there's a couple of forms. I've learned about 15 moves in a form called Yilu. Uh, it's everything that it's advertised to be, and I, I am completely 100% satisfied and uh, very much appreciate the opportunity and plan to continue um, ongoing uh, in this type of training. Uh, thank you. I hope that this has been of some interest to everybody. Hello. My name is Asad al -Salman. I This is my second time practicing Chan style with Master Chan. Zhanghua. I heard about him through a friend. Uh, I found his method very useful, practical. He kind of attaching the theory, he uh, teaches the theory first and shows how, what to do and what not to do. Very useful, straightforward and, and practical. That enough? From today classes, uh, I found uh, the uh, how to lock yourself and hook uh, yourself to the opponent. That's very important, and uh, really uh, I took advantage of that. And uh, the other thing is how, how not to move your center, keep your center not moving. Uh, that is also a very useful thing, a new thing to me. Thank you. Okay. So the question is what I learned on this uh, seminar. My name is Jordan Ajar and this is the third time I'm coming. And uh, every year I come here I try to pick up one or two or three things that hopefully stay with me for the whole year. And uh, this year uh, basically it's the same lesson but I hopefully I internalize it a little bit better. Uh, lesson being non-movement. Uh, uh, non-movement always takes on new meaning, but this year it really meant to me uh, how certain parts of the body do not move, especially uh, the center line, and I have to learn more how to move the internal part, either by stretching, expanding, or splitting. And uh, this, of course, could happen in multiple different areas or different sides of the body, high, low, middle, or center, but uh, as long as I keep one point fixed, and split the other points without moving back, whether it be my head or my, my, my back or my guaz, but try to rotate more and then try to feel myself condense along with the uh, opponent's force. And at some point there'd be, a, a, as they say, a ripping of the onion off your body. 
Uh, most of the time I'm wobbling, as most people. Hopefully every year I wobble a little less. Uh, I know I'll probably never get it, <laughs> but I'm on the path to try uh, and uh, adhere to uh, his philosophy and theories. So um, uh, there's a lot of little details that come along with it, but uh, uh, keeping the bones, as I say, connected, but the space between the bones rotating or moving without movement. So uh, um, adding also, trying to add one or two points connected to the main center line is something I'm going to practice on. Uh, and try to add one, maybe one more point every year. But uh, I did training for the first time or uh, uh, fighting and uh, I felt extremely winded. I wish I was 20 years old again. But uh, I enjoyed it and had fun. I'm looking forward to next year. Uh, what sets uh, Master Joseph Chen apart from all the teachers that I met is that he's actually in the pit with you. Uh, a lot of teachers do not um, engage, as they say, and Master Chen loves the engagement. Uh, he loves getting close, even getting closer, so you actually feel it. Uh, there's no one that I've seen over the many years I've practiced who actually stay with you and try to teach you along the way, and his patience uh, is amazing. Uh, and uh, he's always uh, willing to go the extra mile and share what he thinks will help you. Uh, it would be helpful also if uh, students could engage more in, uh, in questions and uh, the answers hopefully will be uh, shortened or a little more understandable for people on the lower level as myself. Uh, or even uh, private, not private, but like one-on-one -on -one questions. Uh, so this way uh, it gets right to the point. But uh, in general, it's, uh, it's an amazing experience. I'm looking forward to next year. Okay. My name's Susanna. This is my fifth, I think, seminar with Practical Method uh, with Master Chen. So I've been studying for about two and a half years now. The thing that I really appreciate about Practical Method is simply that it is really practical. It's, uh, you start to see, after studying a little while, exactly how it physically works. Like it, it's very practical, it's actually very real. And I appreciate, um, what I appreciate about Master Chen and the way he teaches is that I myself am a primary school teacher, so I really appreciate how clear he is. Um, he's a very competent teacher. He's very good at making things clear to us in many different ways and uh, making it very easy for us okay. to learn. Uh, the thing I, I remember in. most about practical method is don't move, elbow in. <laughs> I think that's basically it. Um, you know, I hope that when you know, after I, when I continue studying, that will really help me to learn how to use my body properly, and uh, so to prevent injuries as I get older. That's it. My name is Greg. Um, this is not the first time I've been to. A Practical Method Seminar, the first time was in 2007. It was the first time I met Master Chen at a seminar in Victoria, BC. Um, I keep coming back to Practical Method because I've tried other styles of Tai Chi um, and I just find this is so much more practical and so much more in-depth and I just get a lot out of the teaching. Um, there's many, many reasons, really, but um, I just find it to be a very complete system and something that you can really understand. And really, there's a lot of, of ways you can work on it and continuously improve, and you um, are constantly um, finding new discoveries, and it gets deeper and deeper as, as you practice. Hi. I'm Josh Landau, and um, I've been training with Master Chen for seven years, and I became a disciple last summer. And I'm here in Toronto from New York, and I get to spend the weekend with Master Chen again. And, you know, it's just amazing. Whenever I see him, um, his instruction always puts me right back on the beam because I go home and I practice, and I practice, and I seem to stray. But whenever I come back here, and whenever I see him, uh, 
sets me straight. This weekend was kind of tough because um, I thought I was doing pretty good until I kind of realized that I don't do too much right. But uh, I'm going to work on that. And I wouldn't know if I didn't see him. And I owe him a lot because um, the practice is part of my everyday routine. And um, gives me a feeling of satisfaction and accomplishment. And I'm very glad to be part of the system. Thank you. My name is Sean Lowry. I heard about Practical Method a few years ago. Um, I actually came across it on a website and I started, purchased a couple of the videos and I found Master Chen's teachings helpful and insightful. Um, this is not my first time attending a workshop. I have been at one in the past. And um, I like how Master Chen teaches because he, he does an individualized approach as well as groups. So if you have questions, you have the opportunity to um, actually ask questions. We'll take as much time as necessary to answer them. And he's actually a very hands-on teacher. So it's not just he'll tell you about it and then you practice with somebody else. He'll actually say, come here, touch me, do it this way. So I find that uh, very helpful. Um, the most, uh, what I remember the most about the workshop um, I think it's always taking away what don't move means, because don't move means everything freezes up. Um, so it's just trying to figure out what that means and being able to put it in your body. So I think that's probably the, the biggest thing I'm, I keep trying to take away from the workshops when I come, is to, uh, to not move and what that means. As well, I have been taking instructions from Kelvin since the end of 2012 up until this point. And um, during his classes, uh, he's also very helpful. He has uh, very detailed instructions on how to move and where to place your hands and your elbows and your feet. And it's um, a very systematic, stepwise approach, so it's easy to learn as opposed to um, just watching the choreography and doing it. He actually has certain steps, almost like um, checkpoints or gears to get through the form to help you do it correctly and make sure you're lined up and that you don't hurt yourself.